Hi Libra, this is Just with your November 11, 2019 weekly reading. I hope you guys are having an enjoyable day so far. So Libra, um, what are you worrying about? Don't worry, Libra. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay, Libra. You are worrying. I don't know what you, some of you guys are worrying about. Um, yeah, but you're worrying. Some of you have to let a situation go. You may have to pay out money. That could be very much a worry. Bad news may have may have come your way or you may be expecting bad news. Something coming to an end. Something... Um, you may be trying to get... Be, listen, be very careful with giving people money. Please be careful, Libra, because I don't feel like you're going to get your money back. And I feel like someone is going to vanish like a thief in the night. So uh, try not to try not to give money. Definitely do not. Um, I also feel like be very conservative. I've never said this, but again, Mercury is in retrograde, guys. And I have um, my cards are pretty much reversed quite a bit. I read reversals. So I do honor that and they haven't, they've just now gone reverse on me. So yeah, for some of you, this will resonate and you have to be very conscious with your finances because you could be paying money out. You're going to take some kind of a money loss. For some of you, it could be 20% up to 60%, up to, I don't know, no, 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 20, 30 and 60 is what I see. So be careful. It could also be in dollars. Yeah, 20, 200, that sort of thing. Keep going. And at 3, 30, you know, uh, 60, 600, that sort of thing. 6,000, and you keep going. Uh, so I do see paying out something, having to take a bit of a loss. Some of you Libra men, whatever you may have, you know, had a, um, what do you call it? You may have had something was a labor of love or you had a, a passion project. You may be letting it go because it's costing you too much money. Um, you may not be getting aid, help, advice. Uh, things are not going your way. Career finances may be kind of a little bit confusing of what's going on. You may be dealing with, uh, yeah, judgments against you. Uh, and you're really not happy. Just like I was telling the other signs where a fire sign kept coming up, water signs can be very problematic at this time, particularly a water female can be very problematic. Some of you may have been dealing with a very manipulating water sign. Um, and it almost feels like you have to play nice to this person until they give you what you deserve, if that makes any sense. Uh, so be careful with manipulating people and also, you know, take a step back if you don't feel very com um, clear about a situation. Because some of you, you may really hate what you do at this point. Just like, I really don't like it and I just really want to start a new job or, or start a new career or just chuck this business and start all over again. And, you know, it's going to be a slow but steady process if you want to start something new, particularly in Capricorn season. doesn't mean that, you know, you have to wait until that time. But I see it being a little bit auspicious because it is a cardinal sign and cardinal signs speak to um, getting things done. They are the initiators. So um, and, and although it does square you. Um, but I do see, um, something starting slow but steady. If you are looking to start a new job, move careers, that sort of thing, start a new business. Uh, yeah, because something, either you're not getting the money, you don't have the passion anymore. Um, you may feel like people are not very, um, people are perhaps disingenuous. You're doing all the work. You're not seeing the, the pay for all the work that you're putting out. Like if something is just completely uneven and some of you may be trying to like strategically leave, but you can't. 100%. Um, you may be codependent on someone. I hate to say that, um, but you may be dependent on someone who themselves can't really be trusted. Uh, or you may need from someone who themselves can't be trusted and they're not giving you what it is that you need. Okay. This person may make all kinds of excuses. They may be irate at times, very angry at times, lash out. But for a lot of you, it could just be you need from this person, whether it be your money that they owe you, um, whatever obligations that they have um, to you. Um, and it's hard to really rely on this person. You have some very unreliable person in your life at this time that you may not even feel like you can trust this person. And you may find that all the time you have to question them and ask them this and ask them that. And they're not telling you the truth. 
is you're not getting the truth from someone. And just when you say, oh, well, damn it, whatever, I don't care. Just, I, you know, I give up. You know, if I have to pay it, I'll pay it. Or if I have to do it, I'll do it. But I think you're getting tired of that, Libra. You really are. And you will get some news at the end of the week or going into next week that's not the best. You're okay. Some of you guys are okay. I feel like Libra men and women are okay. It's just someone is pulling on your heartstrings, if that makes any sense. It could be a child. It could be, you know, family member, coworker. Anyone that you've kind of let in, they may be pulling on your, your um, heartstrings to some extent or dealing with someone who owes you something and you have to pay off something, even though you may feel like it's unfair, that sort of thing. And, you know, you may get the bad news and not so great news or delay in getting the news. You're OK, but you may have felt like you did something foolish and that could very well be trusting them was foolish. Um, making a move with them or, or toward them could have been foolish. So now you're looking like, hmm, you know, if I had this shit to do all over again, I would have never. Um, and in the process to see this thing conclude all the way is going to be a slow process. OK. Um, it's going to be a, a slow process. Okay. It's not all going to just fix itself. And I don't feel like it's going to fix in, in, Le uh, in uh, Sagittarius season either. I think you guys are probably going to have to wait until, um, um, now this is tentative. Okay. So just be, just know that, uh, it may not be, I want to say until like, I keep saying like Capricorn season. 2020 sometime 2010 some of you may be um Taurus season i have to say maybe like i said capricorn season it could be uh, aquarius season mm -hmm. yeah i'll just stick to capricorn and maybe Taurus. like the earth signs i think is more auspicious for you for the situation concluding whatever this is okay um, but if you're trying to get your money back from somebody good luck you may not and if you do get your money back from them this changes the relationship between you and this person Okay, it's going to be very difficult for you to believe them and trust them and want to do anything, whatever you whatever you did, it's going to be very hard for you to be able to do it again with this person because you may have felt like you're foolish or you did something foolish. And you can't stop stressing and worrying about a situation. You know? Yeah, and it can have something like I said to do with finances. And someone may need something from you. And like I said, it, it, you know, their problems now become your problems. Now, when it comes to love matters, uh, I feel like somebody's coming back. They're coming back. They're coming back, Libra. They're coming back. But what else is new? And I don't even feel like this person planned. They didn't strategize. They didn't plan. They just came. <laughs> I'm, I'm, here I am. Hello. Knock, knock, knock. Um, but they are going to be disappointed. They're going to be disappointed. I don't, I feel like if somebody's coming to you and it could very well be that they need something, boy, oh boy, are they going to be disappointed? They're going to be. If you've dealt with somebody in the past that you know plays these manipulating games just to get what they want from you and then you have to track them down, whether it be, um, I need, I need to stay at your place. I need a couple of dollars. I need your name. I need you to sign your name on this. I need whatever. It's not going to work this time. It's not going to work this time. And you're going to be very clear about that. And it includes Libra men. Yes, you love her. Yes, your heart is still involved. And this could be even your child. This doesn't have to be, be very clear, guys. When I say love, it does not have to mean husband, wife, fiancés, boyfriend, girlfriend, live-in relationships, dating, none of that. It can be children, mother, father. It could be brother, sister. It could be those kind of intimate relationships, aunt, uncles, anything. So don't take it so literal. And that being the case, I don't give a damn who it is, okay? You're not having it. That's the bottom line. <laughs> That's the bottom line. It doesn't matter how many knocks is going to be at your door. It doesn't matter what violin has to play in the background of this excuse that they're giving you. None of it matters. No. No. Some of you, just, no. And, you know, you may say, well, let me see what I could do just to get them out the house. Who knows, what, you know, what your delivery will be. But it all adds up to a big fat no, basically. It's, it's, no, you're not going to be foolish. I know what you be foolish, Libra. Um, and I feel like other than you, if you're out here dating, um, it's like Libra men kind of has, you know, those feelings. And you're, come, you're probably letting a couple of people go. Maybe people that is just, you know, you cost too money to date you. Too much, mo too much money to date you. And I don't see where I'm getting anything out of the deal. You know, I can't just kiss you goodnight every night or not even get a kiss goodnight. No, this is not going to work for me. 
Okay, so you may be um, realizing that someone's been manipulating you the whole time and you're trying to probe and ask specific questions to really get the answers that you're looking for. But good luck, because I don't feel like this person's going to be honest. They're not. This person's not going to be honest. They're not going to be honest. Some of you could be dealing with a Virgo because Virgos are struggling with honesty. And it's not all Virgos not being honest. It's them receiving it as well. But I'm just putting it out there. So... I do see that. I do see people kind of moving in silence, being very strategic, manipulating situations, be it emotionally, very much lying or not being very honest. You being done with a situation, feeling as though I'm not going to do that ever again. I've learned my lesson, but it's not over. So something you're still waiting to see how this is all going to pan out. And in the midst of it, you're very stressed out. OK, so be careful if you're out here just dating because you will come across a lot of players and people who I don't care if they're male or female. They are players. OK, and they will exhaust your bank account or waste your entire time. OK, Libra is what I'm seeing here. Um, but the person that's coming back, I do feel like you're going to be quite um, they're going to be disappointed. That's what's going to be disappointed them. They're going to be disappointed. OK, um, however. You know, I don't see the death card. So, well, and the extended will look a little bit deeper. And the strength card is here. Hello. So that does mean people having some kind of control over it. Oh, and the Ace of Pentacles follows. So I do see people having some kind of control over the other person. Maybe being able to compromise and come to an understanding. And you may get your money after all this money you are seeking. Um, and so in the extended, we're going to look a little bit deeper at this relationship. We're also going to look at you Libra singles. In the description box, you can find out what the, the focus will be in a list of focuses that we look at. Not just this week, but further down the line, months to come, we look. So if you're interested, click that link below to the extended and we'll finish up the love reading. If you would like something personal for yourself, click that link to my website and you can set something up for yourself. I would love to hear from you. So if you'd like to leave your comments in the comment section below. And if you're new to this channel, welcome and subscribe because I will be back very soon with another one. Take care, Libra.